Well, a decision could come today in the civil trial against a Kansas City police officer accused of using excessive force. Officer Robert Vivano shot and killed Terry Davis five years ago. The family claims the officer should not have used deadly force. Sarah Hollenbeck was in the courtroom this morning for closing arguments. Sarah. Yes, Cynthia, those closing arguments are still going on, but we are expecting a verdict today. I can tell you both sides were very compelling, and this jury really does have a tough decision. And here's one more interesting thing. If they do side with Angela Davis, they could end up deciding what KCPD should pay in compensatory and punitive damages. So a very big decision that they have today. Now, Angela Davis's attorney spoke to the crowd today, and she hopes that the jury will believe that Terry Davis was on his knees surrendering when KCPD officer Robert Vivona shot him. Court documents show that Davis jumped out of a stolen car and ran from officers while holding a loaded gun, but that didn't give officers the right to shoot him, according to Davis's attorney. While on the flip side, Vivona's attorney says that the officer acted in self-defense. She argued that Davis wouldn't have grabbed a loaded gun before jumping out of a car unless he intended to use it. And of course, this jury is expected to make a decision today. We will bring you the very latest coming up in later editions of 41 Action News. We are live at the Jackson County Courthouse downtown. Sarah Hollenbeck, 41 Action News.